Guys, can you believe that I received five orders today while I was packaging orders? Like, that is so amazing. Five orders. Like, when I was talking to you guys, I'm receiving orders. Thank you guys so much for supporting my small business. It really, really, really means a lot to me. And Hey guys, welcome back to my channel for another video. If you're new here, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. So guys, in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how I package my orders and we're going to have some surprise orders just coming in while I was packaging the orders. And this is like a small business dream to have orders on the day that we are shipping out orders so that the customer that placed the order on that day will get their shipment confirmation on that day. That is a small business dream to have orders on packaging day. So... In this video, I'll be showing you guys how I package my orders, how I get them prepared, all the how I um, the boxes that I'll be using, and all of that. So, if this is the type of video that you would like to see as an entrepreneur, a potential entrepreneur, continue watching. So, guys, the first thing I normally do is just get everything ready. I like to take out the, all the orders and put them one place so I don't have to be going back and forth while I'm packaging orders. So that's what you see me doing there. I normally look at my phone for this and then I print the packing slip later on. So this is what I'm doing, making sure that all the orders that were, that I'm gonna pack, um, they're on the table so that it can be easier for me. Then I'm going to go ahead and sanitize my hand first before I start to packaging these orders. I normally put all my glass containers in bubble mailer and guys these bubble mailer you can get them from Uline as well and anything pieces related boxes, um, tapes, bags, whatever you need Uline have it for your small business. However, if you find it very expensive for, at Uline, you can get them off Amazon as well. Just type in bubble mailer. You might not get these one, but you can get bubble mailers from Amazon and you can um, just use those one with tape. These one, I really like them because I don't need to like tape them because they came, they already came with the sticky pad that I can use and it's super super easy for me so i'm gonna start making some boxes this is just my routine guys whenever i'm packing orders i basically do this so i'm starting making my boxes and the boxes i'll be using is six by six by six and you can also get them off amazon i will definitely leave the link down below for you guys if you guys want to go check them out and also i use the eight by six by four boxes as well and i also use 10 by six by five boxes so it depends on the order and i also use bubble mailers um, as well it depends on the order guys and i have very i have another box that i use as well which is much smaller which is a six by four by three i think it is so that is just only for one item and I will leave that also down below for you guys to go check it out and see if you want to get it for your business. What you see me doing there guys, I actually going through my phone because I keep getting orders while I was making the boxes and I'm like oh my goodness this is so amazing to know that I'm packaging these orders and then I'm receiving orders like this day I received six orders while I was packaging I said five at the beginning but when I check it out it was actually six orders I received so I had to improvise and like make other boxes when I when I was making these boxes
So guys, you see me taking up my phone. That's another order that I just received. And this person, I'm going to show you what she ordered. She ordered the moisture bundle deal, which is the our refresher spray. This is aloe vera and butter refresher spray and the castor oil butter and also Ayurvedic hair growth oil. So I'm making an extra box because I already made the boxes and this is what I've been doing the entire time each order comes I make an extra box. So this is the extra box that I'm making for this order. And the funny thing about it, it's it's the last order to come in at the moment and it's the one first order is gonna get packed. So I'm like, okay, let's pop that order girl. I also use, like to use the bubble mailers or bubble wrap, sorry, with my um, refresher spray bottles because they fit perfectly well as well. The packing peanuts that I use, I got those from um, from Uline, guys, and that's my thank you card. If you purchase from me, you can receive 40% off on your next order. And if you do an unboxing video, send us, tag us in your unboxing videos, and then you can receive 40% off your next order. Sometimes I pack, I put packing slips in the packages, but sometimes I do not. It depends on the amount that I got. Sometimes I don't print the packing slips. And again guys I received two order back to back and that's what I'm gonna show you I'm like trying to show you guys I received two orders back to back and I was printing out the packing slip for them so after finishing to pack all the orders that's what I thought because when I finished these I end up had to pack more orders and yeah this is what i'm doing i'm basically just putting in all the shipping information like the weight of the box so i can print the label and guys i'm going to do a full video on the shipping company that i use here in canada to ship to the us so if this is something that you're interested in don't forget to subscribe to the channel and to click the post notification bell so you'll be notified when i upload that video because you definitely want to hear about this shipping company that I'm using to save money in my small business. So after doing all of that guys, I am basically going over to the shipping company and I already import all the orders into the shipping company from Shopify and I paid for and I'm going to pay for them now so to pay for them what I'm doing, I'm finding the location that I'm going to drop these boxes off and then I click on that location and that's where the location is and I'm just going to confirm that's the location that I'm going to send all the packages to and then I confirm and the good thing about this guys is that you can add like funds to, to this um, account anytime so the total cost for the shipping was like $89 I already did all of the harder work so this is the easiest part is to add the labels to the the boxes right so these are the labels that I use I'll be showing you guys all of that and I'll be leaving all the link to everything down below in the description box if you want to purchase these labels so these labels come with two sides and you can rip off each side so let me get this one off and show you guys 
so it goes off like this and then we're gonna put it on the box want to make sure that we're putting it on the correct box we don't want to mix up the customers ran out of my stickers my fragile stickers so I need to order some So I'm finished to put all the, the the labels on and now I'm gonna like package them up and clean the office area and then get ready to go drop off the packages at the post office. So guys, these are all the packages that I went to ship out. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye guys.